Hello and welcome to Struggle City Podcast. Today we have myself, David. Uh, Nessie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm slowly dying. He really is, though. He's I'm slowly dying. Nessie. And Casey. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on, everyone? Oh, I'm dying. Well, yeah. Just, this is a, a hopefully going to be the first one. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Considering I lost the... 43 fucking minutes of the last one. How did you lose it? I don't know. He know what he's doing. I didn't touch it, so how did you lose it? <laughs> okay, well, I know what I'm doing more than you guys. This is true. I have right. no idea what so I'm doing. so therefore, I'm going to judge you for it all the harsher. Because therefore, you should know. Yeah, but... You have scraps of loose leaf paper about this. <laughs> <laughs> and two emails, okay, that I even emailed myself. Ooh, and and e- Google Docs with <gasps> but, ideas. But her emails. That I came up with. Ugh. That you just like stole from Family Guy and stuff. That's not true. I only stole one thing from Family yeah, Guy. Yeah, grinding it was my funny. gears. That's funny. I mean, we I could really have... enjoyed that. How about tilting the? Oh, I don't. I don't know. Exactly. I... Give me a minute. <laughs> yeah. But there's so many things Give me that grind my gears. Quotation marks. Like I have so many things about that that I took out. So there you go. I come up with topics. Okay. You just you know you you come up with things that you want to complain about. I get it. Yeah, there's, I mean there's that's a slight difference. <laughs> complaining stuff. And it's a then slight Miller, difference. Like I'm, deep questions. Okay. Well, I'm good with deep questions and deep conversations and complaining about things. So like you got a double win with. Me. I'm good with deep penetration. Oh my god. Giggly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So what exactly is our topic today, David? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Well, how's er- how's everyone's week been? Because it's been oh, yeah, a, it's, it's, it's Christmas and shit. It, it yeah, that came up like out of nowhere. It really, it really did. It's really next week. I know. Fucking hell. I know. I had my family party on Saturday, and I was texting my sister because she's hosting it, and she's like, "Yeah, I gotta get everything ready for Saturday." And I was like, "What? This, this <laughs> isn't still like a month away." <laughs> Fun. I do. Can't believe that school ended last week. And yeah. Casey's now officially done forever. Right. Yeah. How do you and, feel about that? Oh my god. He feels that he has to start a podcast to keep his friends together. <laughs> <laughs> I'm. It's not. That's not untrue. <laughs> always be friends with you, Casey. As long as this podcast <laughs> exists. <laughs> Jesus, that's desperate. That's really fucking desperate. Uh. <clears throat> So Dave has mentioned that his week has been filled with alcohol. A lot of it, yeah. Because of a wedding. Well, that was two weeks ago. Was but it? it blends yeah. into one week. It does. It really does. <laughs> it does. <laughs> it really does. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately. <laughs> I don't remember any of it, so I can't comment on it. So. <laughs> Alright, fine. Well, my week has been filled with kickboxing and axe throwing and Getting in shape and all that. All that sounds way more loser. fun than my alcoholic thing. <laughs> well, I mean, that sounds fun. Fucking too. loser. Like, I really do want to get drunk. Who wants to get in shape? Me. Not me. <laughs> <laughs> me, because then somebody won't say that I'm fat. You're not... Jeans. She has no room to fucking talk. I do. I have a lot of room to talk with that. But right. that's I weigh a healthy 189 pounds. How tall are you? I'm 5'9". Now everyone look at my BMI. <laughs> <laughs> And tell me that I am a little overweight, because I already know. I mean, should we actually be talking about, like, weight? I think that's a little... I mean, it's okay. a little if much. Talk about whatever. Okay. If that is the way the conversation is weighing, yeah. then that is fine. Yeah, it just goes how it goes. <laughs> no. I'm like, uh, I think no. I'm like 216, 215. Yeah, but you're like 6'5". He's like six one. Tall. Like 6'1". Like 6'1". You're just really tall. Because Joe's 6'1", and I think you're a little bit... Shorter than his? I mean, we're the same height. Yeah, I think we are. Yeah. I, I slouch. Yeah. I'm blissfully yeah. average. <laughs> <laughs> I'm short. I slouch and I have awkward shoulders. So. Yeah, I'm like 5'1 on a good day, and that's taller than the majority of my immediate family. That's true. Yeah. Because yeah. when, you, when you sent me that picture of you and Sam and, <laughs> and John, holy shit, that's and what and blew John my mind. And Jonathan. <laughs> Jonathan. No one ever calls him John. John. He's 10. I, 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 Jonathan. <laughs> like who, who just names her kid Jonathan anymore? That's that's well, I just forgot. Well, he's named after his dad because that's like such a thing now. Is to like name your kid after the father. That's always been a thing. But I don't oh. like it. I, I was almost a forest. <laughs> that's your dad's name. <laughs> Unfortunately, oh yeah. my god, I love. He's that. just a thicket. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a bundle of sticks. 
Yeah. You're well, a fag. Well, see, that's going to be me. <laughs> Not that part, but... <laughs> like, I mean. if Joe and I ever have a son, like, we have to name him Joseph, because that's, like, a family tradition. That's lame. I broke no. a family tradition. What did you break? Well, why did you My dad His mother's vagina. Third. Oh, oh, oh. What? What? Huh? <laughs> Oh, yeah, side, so. I could have been the fourth, and but my mom was just like, "No boy, no," and mm-hmm. just ended it there. She's like, "You look more like a David." I'm like, "How did you know I look like a David? I looked like a freaking potato when I came out." <laughs> <laughs> potato with a head that's like totally flat. They're like smaller versions of uh, what's his face from uh, Star Trek. Oh, I've never seen Star Trek. I can't. The original Star Trek. I can't remember the name. From what? Um. William Bill Shatner? Bill, yeah. <laughs> they look like smaller versions of Bill Shatner. <laughs> but Bill Shatner now, I'm assuming. Yes, not now. not like not, six, not like sixties Bill Shatner. Yeah, when okay. he was attractive. <laughs> <laughs> not not before like gravity took a harsh fucking toll on him. It does that with people. He got hit hard so hard with gravity that the dinosaurs ex- got extinct. <laughs> Anyway. Remember, you agreed to be well, here. I, I did, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I did. Well, gravity hit Le- uh, Leonard Nimoy harder because he's dead. So he's six, He it hit him so hard, he's six foot on. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and they all clicked off. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Wumble. <laughs> Fuck that up. <laughs> you do that with a lot of things. Fuck it up? Yeah. 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 And you would Thanks. Know that. Thanks. And yet we're here still. <laughs> Thanks. Because of the podcast. <laughs> which no was, which was right which was my idea. Was it your idea? It, it was your idea. It was I came up with idea. the name so like No, you came up with you came up with a bullshit name that we're not using. But that I no, like okay, hold Fuck up. you, I'm right. That, okay, that, <laughs> <laughs> that was my legitimate name. I really wanted the podcast to be Fuck You, I'm right because I say that all the time. And she doesn't. I'm always right. Which Casey has admitted to me numerous times, so don't even. However, my best friend Kelly and I, from way back, we started saying all the time that we were such a struggle and that, like, we were, like, a city, so we're, like, struggle city. And we were going to get t-shirts, and we were going to, like, design them. No. Because now we're going to monetize that, and you can't do that. Which is funny now, because we had to do it, because that was, like, years ago. However, I came up with that, and we were, like, all talking about it in the group chat, and we were, like, which title are we going to go with? And I just decided, like, oh, like, we're such a struggle city. And I didn't mean that as in, like, the title. And everybody was like, oh, I really like that. And I was like, well, no, Everybody I being me and Casey. Yeah. No, I think Sarah And, and Sarah said too, something, yeah. yeah. Her opinion doesn't really matter in this, but okay. Ouch. What if she's listening? Cool. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that, you know, if he she... only meant that because you're not here. It means that somebody's listening. That was a weird fourth wall break right there. I would, all, I would, all, <laughs> I would also say it to her face. Yeah, I see. I'm but I still think Fuck You, I'm Right is a great title for a possible podcast. I mean, it could be a subsect of It definitely could. Uh, we're really good City. at arguing. I'm really good at arguing. Are you? That would have to be way more structured. Are you sure? <laughs> Are you sure you're this good at arguing? So <laughs> I'm not. I'm not hearing any evidence for your supposed goodness. We've been at... friends for a year. I know. We had our bitch anniversary and everything. We did, so like you know that I can argue. However, my arguing tactic is a lot of yelling. It is. <laughs> it is a lot. That's not. It's not a that's, tactic. That's it's just a yelling. Tactic. You're just yelling bullying the opponent into submission. That's just bullying. <laughs> well, <laughs> I mean, like it's better than my negotiating tactic, which is literally like, come on, <laughs> just kill the hostage. <laughs> <laughs> just shoot him. We're out of here. <laughs> you know? Good thing you're not the cop on the other end of that situation. Oh, Jesus Christ! Like, ah, fuck it. We'll Can you imagine her? Money. Imagine her as a cop. <laughs> I, I could definitely be like a bad cop. Like, That'd be hysterical. That'd be hysterical. You can't take the handcuffs home. I that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. I know what you're into. You're into ogres. It's fine. I actually thought you were going to say something, like, legit. <laughs> no! Like, Casey, shut up! <laughs> I mean, you still tell Casey to shut up. Well, yeah, I, I normally do. Maybe, well, you, well, you know you're into ogres because you made me watch Shrek is Love. I, I thought it was Shrek is Love. I don't care. I mean, okay, it's awful. Well, it's a great, I mean, I was forced to watch it, and at this point, it's just, like, a rite of passage, I think. Is it? To watch Shrek is Love, Shrek is Life, or whatever. And Was I supposed to jerk off to it? No. Oh. You were not. It's shooting your goo everywhere. I mean, Shrek <laughs> it's so inappropriate, though. Like, no, Donkey no. did. 
Donkey, Donkey <laughs> was Donkey was a fucking champion in that. No, uh, but there's there's Donkey. evidence of uh, him shooting his goo. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, let's change the subject. Do we have to? Just a couple of I'm jackass really, dragons. Yeah, it was because I was I was gonna like recommend this to my family to be like, hey, <laughs> <laughs> listen to me out here. <laughs> Like, no, well, all well, this. well, here's the thing. You can still recommend it to them. Whoa. You still can, because you know what I've talked to my family about? I've had to explain to my grandmother at Thanksgiving. Your grandma's cool, though. I've had to explain to her what a Dirty Sanchez was. You've explained it to me before, though, I'm sure. How do you not know what a Dirty Sanchez is? I... Is that from Rick and Morty? No. No. <laughs> that's just his last well, name. That's his last name! <laughs> I mean, and Rick is a little dirty. Right. He is! No, it's, it's when... I think it's interchangeable, but you use either your finger or your dick. Oh my god. After putting it in somebody's butthole. Oh my god. And then you make a mustache with what's on whatever appendage you use. Hi, Messi's disgusting. family. What do you mean? I'm disgusting. disgusting. I didn't make it up. That's so gross. I didn't make it up. I'm not so disgusting. Gross. Fuck off. Wasn't there like some other weird thing like that, like with the Lion King? Or like some kind oh, yeah, of like, it's, what is that? It's, uh, it's when you come on your hand and you take your thumb and you <laughs> While she's not looking, you go, Simba. <laughs> right on her forehead. Ew. Oh my god, I totally forgot about that. <laughs> oh. You know what I found out recently, though? Like, literally last night. Oh, where'd you get the Oreo? Do you want it? Do you want Oreos? For a minute? I have... yeah, I'll take it. Nice. What did you figure out last night after you got distracted by the Oreo that was hiding on the laptop? I touched it. I mean, it's good camouflage, but... I, I, I have a bag of them in the oh, fridge if you want some. Ooh, that's a really good idea. Okay, but I found out last night that... In The Lion King, it's not Matthew Broderick who was singing. No. no. A different I didn't yeah. know that. Why he... is that such a thing? Like, let him sing. I really like his voice. Have you heard him sing? Because no. it's Disney yeah. and they can afford a separate singer right. voice. Mm-hmm. Like, like for Nightmare Before Christmas, that's not uh, Chris Sarandon singing. That's Danny Elfman. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And, and also, fuck that movie. The only person that does oh. both, I believe, is Scar. Jeremy Irons, yeah. Yeah, I believe okay. he does both, and he threw out his voice in, uh... Yeah, really? Mm-hmm. Yeah, and, uh, Jim Cummings, I believe, came in yes. and, uh, did, Eeyore. like, some of the movie. Yeah. Eeyore. Good old Winnie Eeyore. Uh, the snake from the Jungle Book. Uh-huh. Yeah, Scarlett Kyle Johansson. <laughs> yeah. That was, the, that was the worst part of that. The entire movie was I mean, Scarlett Johansson is very attractive, though. However, I and don't like her with short hair. What the fuck? Skip slag. Mm. <laughs> I I don't like Scarlett Johansson. I don't think you do. She she's overhyped. She's super overhyped. I mean, I definitely don't like her in the Avengers. I, don't like I mean, that's really all she is anymore. Oh no, she's, she's in a, she's in a really good movie called Under the Skin, where she's an alien seducing men. Oh, super good movie. Hmm. It's on Netflix. Watch it. At least okay. she's been typecasted at this point. She kind of has to be. She's not really talented in any other aspect. Just seduce men and kill like, them. Like Jennifer Lawrence. I mean, that's my girl. I know. She's awesome. I though. love her. She's, I love she's her. Too. fine. I don't know. She's fine. I think she's, she's better awesome. than Scarlett Johansson. Oh, absolutely. <coughs> absolutely. Like, significantly better. Oh, look, Dave. Oh, look. It's a fucking raven. Oh, look. It's a fucking raven. Oh, my God. He's playing some stupid I'm actually, I'm actually surprised you found one. Look, it's a fucking raven. Ravens aren't even that awesome, so... Ravens are crows. And it's dead. No, they're different. They are. They are They're's very different. different. And you know how I know that because I really want to get a crow tattoo, so I'm looking up the differences between crows and ravens like every other day. It's like the one one of the few animals I don't want to eat. What crow? Yeah. You know they don't always mean like bad things. They can mean really good things. No, I I know that. It's not because of like that. superstition or anything. It's just <laughs> they don't look tasty. They're super cool though. I mean, I think people would really judge me if I got a tattoo of this. So, like, I needed a different bird. <laughs> I mean, is it if they, not unless you, uh, like, <clears throat> added something else Canadian to it? Like, maybe the Canadian <laughs> flag. Oh, no, no, yeah, that's Canadian. Yeah. That. Boom, right there. Just throw the goose next um, to your Well, leaf. no, you, you, could have the, you could have the crow, like, ejaculating maple syrup. Oh, my God, you're disgusting. I have maple syrup in the car. Caca, Ew, eh? why do you have maple syrup in your car? Um, I went out to dinner with my grandma when she took me shopping. And was it like a bring your own maple syrup place? No, we went to Cracker Barrel and I Ew. got French toast, which was really good. And they give you like a little bottle of syrup instead of like a regular B-Y-O-S, syrup. BYOS, bring your own syrup. Jesus Christ, oh my God. BYOMS, bring your own maple syrup. Okay. Let's well, let's not limit it. There's other kinds of syrup. Maybe some people like corn syrup and all that gross stuff. Cough but syrup. We're, it's like 
<laughs> yeah, let's just pour a little bit of cough syrup on some Ooh, pancakes. Yeah. Let's get a little high. I, yeah. I have told you that story, right? Where no. I was like high as a child. Because I would drink cough syrup all the time. <laughs> Did I not tell you that? What, no. what kind of childhood you did you live? I have told you that before. Did you? Okay, so here's the thing. I'm not totally crazy. Um, Debatable. <laughs> it's true. Okay, so when I was a kid, we had this cough syrup that was grape flavored. And oh, was, yeah, you did tell me this. Yeah, and it was so good, and it would always make me feel better. So my logic as a kid Sound was... Sound logic, I can see. Uh, right, yeah. <laughs> can you? <laughs> was that I can, yeah. Even if I was healthy, I would drink this cough syrup because it would prevent me from getting sick. So I would literally drink cough syrup all the time. And like I was probably high as a kid. Probably. My dad also would give me sips of his beer when I was younger. Which is fine. Yeah, every I think yeah. every parent's done that at least once. Well he did it so that I wouldn't like beer and it worked because beer's now. You never had However, good beer. Well he I mean he gave me yingling, so like No, I don't know. you don't yingling's, okay. yingling's garbage. I wouldn't I, so. I wouldn't water my plants with that shit. Well I liked it when I was a kid. Apparently like he gave it you to me. You also drank cough syrup as a kid. <laughs> <laughs> you probably took it. You took a shot of cough syrup and then drank some yingling. <laughs> this is my childhood. <laughs> Five-year-old Missy is fucking walking around drunk as a skunk. <laughs> he says he has like various like vivid memories of him like handing me his beer and then like turning around for something and then coming back and I'm like this, <laughs> like completely like just devouring it. But I don't remember. So you were a drug addict as a child and an alcoholic. <laughs> I grew out of, I grew out I grew out of, of it. it. You grew out of your alcoholism and drug addiction. I don't know why people have these problems nowadays. You can just grow the fuck out of it. You just have to survive it. Drug addiction is not a disease. <laughs> Clearly. Oh Exhibit A like, right here. Like alcoholism. Alcoholism is not a disease. Oh my god. I can't really grasp that now. <laughs> <laughs> talk for a while. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're the most talking about it, the two of us. We're pretty like, quiet. I was going to say that's because I'm a girl, but that's a little sexist. That's a just, little? It's also very true. Yeah. I mean, I, yeah. I get pretty talkative when I get drunk. I don't want you to get drunk right now. It's like not even 2.30 in the afternoon. All right, we'll tell that to David on Saturday. Yeah. I got drunk at like 10. Okay, yeah. but what were you doing all day? <laughs> like, literally, the only reason uh, I'm I not... had work. <laughs> yeah, oh, shit, all right. <laughs> like, the only reason I'm not drinking is because I wouldn't be able to taste it, and I just bought new beer, and I want to taste it. Right, that's fair. Right, so... Yeah, I had to be Santa on Saturday. I saw. That was gross. Yeah. You were Santa? Ho, 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 motherfuckers. Gross. Oh, my God. Yeah, it was great. I got the whole pup. It wasn't for children. I only held one baby. That's bad. Which was, it was okay. How old Did the mother baby? know? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no. Ooh. <laughs> um, but uh, the baby was like, baby. Like baby, baby, where you have five. to hold it like this. No, it was like five months. It was able to sit up. Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice. I might be completely it's better wrong. Than a that's, like a, that. that's yeah. such a weird standard for growth. Like, oh, it can stand up by itself. Yeah, it can Oh, it cannot die. As dolphins well, are fucking flaunting around in the ocean right. by themselves right after right. vaginal birth. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. It's a good sound. But there was a lot yeah. of puppies. Like, r really tiny ones. I think I held, like, a, a four-week-old puppy. Oh, my God, stop. It was adorable. <laughs> it was so the funny. softest thing in the world. And you had to, like, wear the beard and the hat and all that. Oh, my God! Where is the picture? I can show you. It's on oh. Facebook. Yeah, it's on it, Facebook. It really? Abby posted a couple. I took a picture of my doggos. Mm. I saw the one of you and your dogs and mm -hmm. with Abby, right? Yeah. Yeah. Abby says, Carol, for you. Oh, what the hell? That poor girl. Why are you going to Pokemon Go? I have <laughs> Pure habit. <laughs> Don't oh judge. God. Like, I got here, and the both of them were just playing Pokemon Go. For a, a good solid like ten minutes. Uh, it was not ten minutes. It totally Fuck was. Off. It I'm, was not ten I'm minutes. Being generous. By saying ten minutes. You're so fucking dramatic. This is true. I'm not denying. It was. We were. Oh my gosh. We were battling, and it was like five minutes. That's each so shit. great. You know it's great. Mm -hmm. Um, I think I think it was this Saturday. Mm -hmm. I actually ended up taking a nap at Santa Claus in the <laughs> room. I was asleep for like a solid thirty minutes. Nice. That's all you're supposed to nap for, too. Like, you're not supposed to nap for long because then it messes you up. Because that's just sleep. Well, anything, anything <laughs> longer um, than an hour, you shouldn't be woken up. But after two hours, it's fine because you've reached REM sleep. So, and so you're going out. You should cycle. just be, like, put down after that after that time? I mean, you can put me down anytime. <laughs> we did that one day. Yeah, <laughs> we two ro days. Yeah, we roasted what? you. Just uh, <laughs> Y'all weren't even here. Pat just continued in that I know, day. I know. <laughs> Well, there was just a day in Rampelli's class where Pat, Dom, and I just roasted the fuck out of Dave. Mm, that sounds like fun. It was great. I was feeling <laughs> was very depressed that day, oh and you know what? 
have brought me out of my depression. <laughs> okay, well, good. Good. <laughs> Laughing at yourself, best way to feel better about yourself. <laughs> Right, I am a complete total. I don't even remember shit. half the shit we said to you. Neither do I. <laughs> I know there. at some point there was like something about marshmallows or something. I don't know. Was there? Yeah, probably. I don't even remember. We need to text Pat. Get him back over here. Well, we should get Pat on the podcast because he's hysterical. I love Pat. He can be funny. Yeah, we should do like a 20 minute video of him just ripping on me. <laughs> he does it with such ease. He does. It was It was a little saddening at how easily. Right? Yeah. Like he was just waiting. He he said, just like, the way he says stuff, too, is so funny. But, like, the awkward thing with Pat and I is that, like, if we're hanging out together, like, just the two of us, yeah. I don't know what to say to him to make him say something funny. And so then it's, like, super awkward. But then whenever, like, Dom is with us, because she adores Pat, she adores him, so she's, like, always, like, laughing with him and talking with him, and then he'll be super funny. Mm. Which Dom? I just kind of observe. Huh? Your Dom or the other Dom? My Dom. Okay. The... <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Excuse me. No, uh, this this is allergies. Oh. I'm I'm dying all the time. <laughs> okay. I'm on like three different medications <laughs> for, for allergies. Yeah. I'm not on enough. I'm not gonna comment on that again. <laughs> I mean, you drank cough syrup as a child, so you're all. But blessed. I grew out of it. <laughs> That's what she's telling us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's very different from what we know. <laughs> I mean, I'm pretty fun when I get drunk, though. She hides a little... Uh... <laughs> you are. You're one You're one cup drunk. However, okay, that makes me sound like... Dr. Like class. Such... Oh, my God, okay. Hi, <laughs> Dom! <laughs> oh, snap! Just okay. an afternoon of oh, snap. Okay, so I decided to live my life on the edge a little bit. And, Case and, I... and anybody that says that is just <laughs> automatically not living their life on any sort of edge. She stopped no, this, living her life on the edge after this, the age of 10. This counts as living on the edge a little bit. Okay. Just a little bit. Does it? Case and I went out to lunch one day in between our classes, and I decided to get an alcoholic beverage. <laughs> which, yes, I only needed one. However, it was a Long Island iced tea, which is like four to five shots in there. So don't judge me. And I just, I'm a small I just did. person. A little bit. I'm anymore. judging a little bit. Oh my god. I'm judging. I'm sure I only had one. <laughs> uh, that day? I yeah. think you had like one and a half. Okay, one and a half. We one and a half. Right, but like, keep, so. keep in mind, I had four beers. That's beer versus like shots. Right, but like we both were on a relatively empty stomach. But you're also 6'1", and I'm 5'1 on a good day. <laughs> well, wait, so you're... <laughs> on a good day. <laughs> what? <laughs> if I'm wearing those shoes, yeah, with heels. But anyway, so I get a little drunk. And he drove, which was good. So we went back to class, and we're just sitting in our class waiting for a class to start. And we had a couple people who were coming in, like, one at a time. And everybody who came in, I would, like, throw my arms up in the air, and I'd be like, Dom! When Dom came in. And, and then, we, al- we also had the desks stacked together so that you could lay on top of them. That's right. I was laying yeah. on the desk. So you're, like, full Kate Winslet. <laughs> <laughs> but then this one girl, Jenna, came in. And I was like, oh, snap! It's Jenna. And I did that, like, repeatedly as people came in. You used to love her. Up until she lied. She lied to me about having a kid. And it was just like, why would you lie about that? But it wasn't a lie. It was just a joke. But it was a lie. It was just a joke. It's just a prank. No, because she went on with it. She was just having a chuckle. But we just watched a movie that day, so it didn't even matter that I was drunk. And then I took a nap. Yeah, you felt felt the fuck asleep. So did Dr. Mike. Because she's 110. She was very old and, and cripply. Not was. <laughs> no, was. She that, is alive. She's fucking dead because she's a hundred. She's, 100, not dead. I she's very dead. I remember the one day that she tracked dog shit in the classroom. <laughs> were you Were you in that class? No, I'm. Oh, I, I'm taking Brit now. I'm taking Brit lit now. No, it was American oh. lit. Was it American lit? It was American lit. Are you sure? Mm, no, because no, American lit. lit was later it, on in the day. Brit lit oh, one wait, was we had right. Both that day. Right. That's what I mean. But it was like worse. you were there for American Lit because yeah, I was there that day. But no, I think I think it was I think it was worse during American Lit because she had been spraying your Victoria's Secret host dank all over herself all day. She, she asked for perfume to get rid of the smell, so I gave her my perfume. So you gave her the female equivalent of Axe. Um, I mean, it is a great smelling perfume. I'm wearing perfume? it today. I can't smell I can anything. Smell I can't smell anything today. Yeah. All right. Well, just trust me that it smells good. <laughs> Okay. I showered in like three days. I needed some perfume. Same. <laughs> Fucking shower. Except Sha- I don't wear perfume. The shower, you savages. Well, all the well, time. Well, there's no point when I'm going to go kickboxing tonight and then I'm just going to have to shower after that. 
Okay, then shower after that, you fucking savage. I just have to wash these clothes tomorrow, and there's no point in taking a shower now. Exactly. So I'm just going to shower this weekend. We're doing the podcast right now. It's We're good, talking to it's people. It's a good thing I can't smell you. That don't exist right now. But they will later. I don't think so. <laughs> None of us exist. It's fine. No, we should definitely do the podcast for actual reasons of people will listen to us rather than the reason of we're just doing it to hang out. Because. Why, but why can't it also be. It's, but it's like, if it's just us that's going to be like doing this and listening to this later, it's <clears> the same <throat> as us yeah. talking. Well, yeah. Regularly. So why would we need the mic and the equipment and all that? It, but it, can it also just be masturbatory in the sense that we're also just getting pleasure out of doing this? But yeah. then we could just talk. But but now <laughs> we wouldn't need to. But it's it. also now up available for posterity. Yeah. So this way, now we know what we said because ninety percent of the time we forget anyway. Right, because we we just talk I shit. I just think it would be better if people would actually listen. They I will. Mean, people will listen. <laughs> they will. There's like no argument. We'll, see. well hmm. yeah. Eventually. I don't know if I'm gonna recommend it to my family anymore. <laughs> you can still recommend it to your family. After yeah. After all that you've said. What have I said? Fuck you, let's recommend it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. I, I have said fuck quite a few times on here. Don't need to say it again. Ah, shit. If that's, <laughs> if that's the least of your concerns, is just saying fuck every now and then, I think you're fine. Well, for my... Uh, right. I mean, you did mention shoving a finger up someone's butthole at some point. Yeah, Sometimes you get squirrely. But that could also be a, um, a doctor doing so to check your health. I uh, know, it was direct contact with Dirty Sanchez. So but, I mean, it exactly. Could be. <laughs> All the butts. <laughs> All of the butts. Oh, I love puns like that. They're so much fun. Which, did I tell you that I got. Um, oh, tons of fun. Yeah, but I got my <laughs> practicum teacher a thank you card, and it had cows on it, and it was just so many puns on the card. It was great. It was like, thank you, dairy much. Oh my god. <laughs> it was fantastic. I'm legitimately surprised you didn't throw out my Christmas card. I'm also proud of you for not doing it. I haven't looked at it. It was a really good Christmas card. It really wasn't. He built this up so fucking much, and then I come over here, we exchange gifts, we do our little bitchmas, and... Bitchmas. Yes. <laughs> and he gives me the card, and I open it, and there's pigs on it. And for those of you who don't know, I hate pigs. And so, what did it... It had a pun with it, though, that made it okay. What was the pun? Deck the hogs with boughs of holly. And it's just like three pigs stacked on top of each other. Yes. It was great. It really wasn't. He knows it's pretty how good. much I hate them. They're it was just pretty like good. the worst That's creatures why I did it. ever live. Like, people say that like, a goat is like the devil's animal. No, like, they have it totally wrong. It's a pig, for sure. But pigs don't have horns. I don't care. They have, they have like tusks. They will eat you. A That's goat a, won't eat you. That's a boar. But it's it's still a pig. It's still a pig. Yeah. Okay. At least in my book, it's the same thing. Like, it's, it's, it's the, the same, same thing. It's the same family. Right. I guess. They're just nasty Ow. creatures. What did you do? I threw my phone at my foot. What did you do? <laughs> what did you do? All right, let me see what your uh, Google Docs sign. No, I want to see what topics I remember. Which I still love your screensaver. He has Appa from Avatar. <gasps> they, they're doing Funko Pops for I know, Avatar. I know, I know. I'm surprised they haven't Coming out January. Already. Uh, they might have had trouble. Yeah, with licensing. The <laughs> they look pretty cool. I'm not gonna get them, but they look cool. I might, I might try to get um, the Ang, uh, what's it called? Yeah. Uh, Chase. Oh, good luck. Yeah, I know it's gonna be a pain in the ass. When it finally comes out, it's gonna be like a couple hundred dollars. Oh, Jesus. I like. I'm kind of over Funkos right now. Well, what? you Who went, are you, you went to the Pop Factory, so. Well, no, I just well because I hate. <laughs> The I hate the culture of it. I hate the pop hunters. <laughs> the pop hunters. Oh my God. There are you pop are hunters. You are so one of those. I am entire, not. I you am, have a wall of pops. That's actually not that bad. It's Compared not that bad. Yes, it is. First of all, Trust it's not me. that bad. Shut the fuck up. Second of all, I don't hunt. I don't go exclu- I don't. I don't go searching from store to store to store on release days. If I find one, I find one. Red. If I don't. I'll, I move on with my fucking life. There's a lot of um, death questions that I came up with. Were you I'm in a dark surprised. place? I don't know. <laughs> Surprise. It was like two weeks before uh, finals. Finals. So I'm like, <laughs> it was longer than that. Yeah, so it I was. only had one final, which was... I got a C on. I'm so <laughs> I don't get C's. Last time I got a C you... was like maybe like seventh, eighth, ninth grade. Maybe she's got a better yeah, job. Yeah, she only gets A's because she's up. a little bit. <laughs> 
Do you really just want to tell that story all over again? No. Shout out to Dr. Mike. No, that's alright. I'm, <laughs> I'm already not telling that story again. <laughs> Yo, we should get Dr. Mike to listen to this. She'll be so proud of us. We have to do a seance. Yeah. Oh my <laughs> god, no. She is alive. I actually would totally be okay doing a seance. Like, do you guys watch Ghost Adventures? No, I don't. No, that guy's, a, that, thing that guy's a okay. fucking Okay, so that's goofball. what I thought at first, too. Like, I thought it was very fake, and they were just, like, you know, making everything up. However, Joe is, like, super into it. And so we were watching it the one day, and I, like, legitimately get scared with ghost stories because ghosts can, like, be a real thing. But I was also scared because, like, all of, like, the, like, what is that word I'm looking for? Where, like, they super. act out what happened. Reenactment. Yes, Re-enactments. that word, yeah. yes. They were like legitimately scary, and they did that on purpose. All right. Really it, in the show. If we watch Ghost Adventures as a group, we also have to watch Mountain Monsters as a group. What was that? Is oh, that Bigfoot? That is Bigfoot. Jesus. But so you don't like ghosts, but you like Bigfoot. Because there's more evidence for Bigfoot. There's not. Yes, there is. There's so much evidence for ghosts. No, there's not. Yes, there is. No, there's not. There's yes, actual there fossil evidence of Bigfoot. There's evidence of ghosts. Look at people who look at like exorcisms for God's sake. Look those are not houses. those are those are misdiagnosed mental illnesses. Oh no 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 no. Yeah. yeah. No. Yeah. I'm, no. I'm on Casey with that one, but oh I I've seen a ghost, so I mean like I believe in ghosts. There you go. I believe that they look at like Ouija boards. They work. No, no they don't. Yes, they do. no, they're they're don't. sold yes, by they Mil- do. They're sold by Milton Bradley. The same company that sells Monopoly sells okay, Ouija well, boards. Okay, well, Monopoly is just the worst game ever invented. Let's get that. You would have better luck summoning a demon with Monopoly <laughs> than you would with a Ouija board. It is apparently not because Dom and I played a perfectly civil game of Monopoly. Well, it's How not that... that it can't be civil. It's boring. It is very boring. It's so boring. It brings boring. the worst out of people. It does. It summons demons, if you will. <laughs> it summons internal There's demons. There's so many other board games that are so much better. Like Risk. I another mean, demon that. <laughs> that's a great game. It's better than Monopoly. It's like a, that's a low bar, though. It, it is. It's, it's like right above it. It is just as tedious, but there's more to do. Is there... I mean, Nerds yeah. is also a pretty great game. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. Fuck you. In the... but Ooh, not as doggo! Die, doggo. Oh, it's a lava doggo. Bad dog. I don't understand boys and video games. But I never will. My girlfriend plays video games too. But is it all day? Look at this. Look at this. No, about watch, this. And watch this. So watch this. Watch this. Excited about this. Look at all the violence that is going on. You know that they come up with video games about school shootings. How messed up is that? That's true. Yeah. Well, that's that's, messed up. that's Steam. Steam is a shithole. Steam is like, like Steam is literally hell. And like, like Joe. Steam is like video game Tumblr. His gaming too, but I just. Can't that's that's fine. It's just yeah, it's, you, I you, like you. to distract myself. Why are you distracting yourself? You're hanging out with friends. I'm when I'm not hanging out with you people. <laughs> like I'm, last time oh. I did mention that he probably shouldn't play video games while we're doing this. But so, I'm I'm still participating. Well I'm, I'm participating. I'm so impressed that we're not talking about video games You're right so now. Impressed. <laughs> I this is your bar for being impressed. It is a higher, it is oh, is a low bar. Think of it as because it's but, solely because you're here. It's all because you're here, miss. Because last time, I mean, it yeah. could have been a let's oh. play if we were recording the screen. I can't say it. Like, if you guys want to do let's plays, go for it. I will not be here for but, that. There's, like, one or two I would like you to participate in just Which because. Ones? I think horror games would be fun. Yeah. Oh, that would be fun. I love well, horror games. I recommended a horror game to do, and you're like, no, I don't want to do that. It sounds well, stupid. Well, wait, do you mean me playing it? <laughs> Well, you can you can interact and help with it. Yeah, like Cause Cause I don't want to play. It would I be don't me play. or Dom playing it. <laughs> okay. Because we're both little chicken shits when it comes to this. Stuff. Well, the yeah. the only one I have is Until Dawn, and that's mostly dialogue driven, and mm-hmm. it's, it's also a walking sim- simulator at times. <laughs> yeah, it would be more like jump scary, like I don't know, um, Slenderman or some of that. Oh yeah, because Slenderman degree. Slenderman is like two bucks. Uh, I'm okay with spending two bucks I still on that. I don't know his story. So it's it's stupid. It's pretty dumb. <laughs> Well, but a lot of people think good. that the horror genre in general is just dumb, but I love it. I think it's so much fun. Because it's not done right anymore. No, well, there's there's very... I think the last time it was done really well might have been, like, It, maybe? Like It was good. Like, it, was, it was okay. It was okay. It's got my boy in it. It could have been... It was a, it was a great movie, but trapped within a good movie. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> Like, it felt like there could have been a lot more... There could have been so much more. ...drawn out of it without crossing that line. Yeah. Um, I've I mean, never read the book, so... 
I, I'm going to read the book one day, but it's like a thousand pages. It's right there. It's yeah, huge. It's it's, it's eleven hundred, I think. Yeah, yeah. So I need I need some time. Like that might be like during retirement. <laughs> <laughs> And it's it's like my favorite book to read during the summer for some reason. I always reread it during summer. Yeah, yeah, we should read it during the summer, do a group read, and discuss it over this. Yeah, have, See, I would be very okay with doing that with other books as well. Have Dom, have Dom read it, too. Yeah, I think. Oh, uh, uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> She's terrified of clowns, and she would not be able to do it. Like, we... By terrified, do you mean it's her secret fetish? No. I mean, when we be. went to Field of Screams, we oh, had yeah. to, like, protect That's her from did. clowns. Which was so funny because we weren't even like we didn't even buy the tickets yet. We were in line, and this clown comes up to me and she grips onto me yep. and like, like has a full her like face. slight panic attack. Too. Yeah, and like she really started crying. I felt really bad for her. I was like, "How the fuck are you gonna do this? Like, there's she, clowns everywhere." And then there was that one bit in the, well, the, the yeah, hayride, the hayride, the hayride yeah. where they're in the the thing. Yeah, they come into the and wagon, she, and she pooped a little. Wow. <laughs> she did not. She pooped a little. But it was so much fun to have them She'll come have into. Residue. <laughs> into the wagon. Or should I say a recipe? Oh my god. <laughs> you shouldn't. <laughs> it's already there out there. There was that one clown, though, that got her before we got onto the hayride, though, and neither one of us saw it. Like we were Oh, trying, yeah. yeah. He was sneaky as fuck. We were fuck. trying to protect her from this one that the both of us saw, and then all of a sudden, like, she lifts her head from my shoulder, and he's, like, right there. Yeah, she he screams, was sneaky. He freaks out. Oh my god, I felt so bad. I was like, I didn't see him, I swear. So, like, he... that's, that's impressive. <laughs> But it's hard. It's hard to dis- to determine what's a clown and what's a juggalo sometimes. So it's it's a real it's a gambit. A juggalo is like white trash, basically. Oh, uh, they're a they're a fan of the insane clown posse. ICP. I mean, I think that's fun though. Just insane clowns, evil clowns. Yeah, have you listened but to their music? Listen to any of their music? Oh, this is music we're talking about. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, they're a band. They're, 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 I didn't know they were a band. They're white rappers. Oh. If you want to call him that. <laughs> no, the only white, white rapper makers. that I think is decent is Eminem. He Logic's pretty good. Logic's good, yeah. I, I, I like don't Logic. Know a lot of rap. I mean, do you count Tyler as a no. rapper? Okay, then good. Yeah, just Eminem. Just Tyler. Joseph from the pilots. Oh uh, no, he's not a rapper. He's like alternative. But yeah. he also raps. Okay. He's a rap he, rap. he is a rapper in the same way Chester Bennington was a rapper. He's also a rapper he's in the same way that Bo Burnham is he's fine. a rapper. Who's that? Uh, who's that? Bo Burnham? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's a name? comedian. Oh. Songwriter. Slash. Have you shown me him before? Yes. Okay, that's why. Yeah, yeah, he's funny. Okay. He's hilarious. He's quite clever. He is also nominated for a couple Golden Globes this year. As he should be. Yeah. That eighth grade was amazing. And uh, okay. she it, is... Mm, okay. So I watched, I watched eighth grade. Mm-hmm. It was okay. You don't like anything good. For a breakout uh, writer and director, it was a great first film. It was fine. Yeah, it was. I'll give it that, but like on a technical level, it was really boring. Oh, the pacing was way off. The pacing yep. was boring. He didn't know. He doesn't know how to shoot anything. No, not yet. Well, I didn't see it, so I can't uh, comment on that one. But I did see it to all the boys I've loved before, Ew. which was like Never a huge. That. that was a huge deal too. Like either right before or right after eighth grade, and. It was not that good. No, because it's it's a tween book. Yeah, I'm really, but Dom was in love with it. Because that's her genre. Yeah. <laughs> that's her fucking genre. Yeah. She hates mush. I love mush, but that was the bad kind of mush. Like, I read good mush, but like that was Ooh. just terrible. I sold somebody Colleen Hoover books today. <gasps> really? Which one? Really? Um, Someday Maybe. Because that was the first one I read. Oh my god. It's such... Anybody who's possibly <laughs> listening, you should definitely read... A Colleen Hoover book. It's like the mushiest they're romantic fun. tale, but it's not like they're, they're so terrible. hilariously bad. They're not bad. They're fun. Like they're, they're the kind of mush where it's like you put your hand over your heart, and you tilt your head a little bit, and you go, "Aww." That's like, only that's fun. only that's only because you're about to throw up. <laughs> I, I feel like I could be the deciding factor in between. Them. There, okay, I've like never read it. I can definitely recommend. Yeah, them. once I, once I finish this one, there, it's fun romantic B movie shit. It's, it's cute. Is it better than Jane it, it's, a, it's a movie yes. that will make you... It's a movie. It's a book that will make you feel good. I What's enjoyed them. I enjoyed them. Good. I didn't say there was anything wrong with that. Just, just, they're just bad. But they're yeah. delightfully bad. But let's make one thing clear. Casey and Hates I everything. have very different views on everything. Which is why we work so well as friends. He doesn't like anything we, good and I like everything. We hardly have ever agreed on anything. This is really true. And I've... Yeah... I think this I is the first thing everyone has consents, you know. Yeah, but we on. all fought over the name and what we were going to talk about and, like, how it was going to work. And yeah, until David decided to step in and yeah. take charge a little bit. <laughs> and yeah, said, all right, Struggle fight. City sounds like a great name. 
we didn't fight. We we just you know debated. Put things on hold for three months. And then <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really did. the name was the biggest issue. That it we really had. shouldn't have been, but it golly, was, it was. I still can see and hear exactly how you told me this one, and it was like the worst name I've ever heard in my life. Which one? It was when you guys were going through that whole rooster where? teeth stage, where it was like, oh, let's just put two random words together and it'll be fine. And so he he. He's like talking to me about this, and he's like, "Oh, I came up with another one." And he like sits there and thinks about it for a second. And he's like, "Exploding moons." <laughs> like, <laughs> that sounds like an anime. Like, What's wrong with exploding I can't, moons? I can't. No. I could just hear the Japanese oh. theme song. In but the it's, it's just it works well no, if we had. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Shut up, darling. No, it doesn't. <laughs> it works well if we had a title card, because we draw out the moon and then we put oh our god, faces no. in the O's. Oh my god, do you hear this idea? And then Japanese who, music plays. Who on earth would listen to a podcast that says exploding moons? Like, I just can't you don't say it like that. You don't say it like some boring ass <laughs> basic vanilla but bitch. It is boring. Like, seriously, I cannot get you know, Every time I think about this little encounter that we had, I laugh my ass off. It's so dumb. Exploding moon. It's so dumb. Granted, it does sound like a cow a little bit, and I do love cows. I love eating cows. You're terrible. Mm. And then the Japanese music plays. <laughs> <laughs> How long are we, have we been doing this? It's been 41 minutes. Nice. Wow. Does yeah. How long are we planning on doing things? Um, I'm aiming for about 45. Now that we're like really breaking the fourth wall here. Ooh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm aiming for 45 because that's where we ended last time, and okay. that was about right double where I needed to be. Then I just need to cut that. So, so then, are we yeah. good for the day, or are we doing another one? We can do another one. Okay. Yeah. Good. So I drove like an hour and a half yeah. here. No, we could just keep doing it. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's are fine. you staying for dinner, Dave? I mean, I don't have to. No, you're welcome to. I know I am. <laughs> <laughs> I just didn't know if you were or not. Uh, probably. Where's my probably not. It's pork. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> he knows me so well. It's fucking pork. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah more, more than likely, no. <clears throat> no? Okay. Yeah. That's fair. Yeah. 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 So now we're saying we have a thing to do not knowing what to say. But I could cut this all out. This could this not true. happen. <laughs> Everything from the 41 minute mark to now yeah. could be gone. Yeah, but don't we have to like be like, oh, thanks for I can, whatever. I'm very selective. I, can, okay. I don't want to thank anybody for anything. Where we could keep this all in, because no I one's just, listening, so fuck it. Well, somebody <laughs> might be listening when we put it up, is what I'm saying. So like... Yeah, let's let's, pre- subscribers. let's pretend this is actually real. I feel no need to thank anybody. And not just for us, because that makes me feel like it's more important than just for us. Well, the way I'm looking at it is, it is for us. Screw everybody else. Yep. Mm. Uh, we, Fuck see, we have very different views on it. Fuck I mean, as long as we get to the same result, that's all that matters. Right, no, I, I'm enjoying this. It is fun. It is like a good discussion and, and to have, yeah. you know, time to get <laughs> our friends to shut up. However, I think it would just be more beneficial if, like, we actually, like, did something with it. Of course, of course. Right. Like, I, I, so far, I created a logo, and I'm, 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 like, seriously taking this very seriously because I actually want to do this. I am as well. The more serious it gets, I feel like, then, like, if we want to be really serious, then we have to post it and assume people are going to listen, and that way we'll take it more seriously because people are listening to us. Of course. Right. Uh, I mean, right. that's we, the last, we also can't forget yeah. to, yeah. to market. Yeah, 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 of course. That works. Yeah. We didn't say our last name. No, no. Okay. Cool. No, like, so, yeah, so we're on, Dave, we're on the same page. We got this. We're on the same page, same just page. a different book. It's fine. <laughs> no, it would make more sense if we were in the same book. You people page. have been playing chess the whole right. time while I've been playing checkers. <laughs> Uh, I don't know how to play chess. Well, that's an entire thing. What? <laughs> Hang on, wait. Wait, do you know how to play chess? Yes, I how, know how to play chess. How do you not know how to play checkers? I mean, is it as simple as, like, you just, you know, I mean, no, well, no. Other? I get her understanding how to play chess because she's a secret racist and she'll always <gasps> pick white. Ooh, so you go first. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> that's so not okay. The chessboard that my mother uh, and You're I the used. secret racist, not no, me. No, no, the chessboard that my mother and I used, there were clear pieces and then there were white pieces. And I always went for the clear ones. Oh. So, so if you're taking this back... So you can't have black pieces oh in your game. Oh my god. So if you're taking this back to, like, the color of water, that fucking book, I am God. The color so of water. So there you go. That's even worse because now God's a racist. <laughs> It's true. <laughs> what the fuck is the color of water? I had to read it. Isn't it just clear? Yeah, but it was... It was <laughs> it's just clear. 
<laughs> it was like a summer reading book for high school that I had to read, and it was just really stupid. It was about racism and, and all that. But, like, it was so boring. That's... <laughs> like, all summer reading books are it's your terrible. Can we agree on that? Not anymore. Why? What are they well, writing now? Uh, John Green. Like, some really... Serious? John Green's garbage. He is serious? garbage, but he's popular. He is terrible. I'm surprised... When, when I worked at Barnes, I was surprised at the way summer reading list went. Yeah. Because now they're including, like, Stephen King. Oh, get John out Green. of here! It's... It's amazing. I'm just like, That's wow, mean. what a time to be alive. Is it yeah. like good Stephen King though? It's um, uh, it's like the weaker side of Stephen up. King. Yeah. yeah, it's like Pet Cemetery, which Pet Cemetery is a bad book. Mm. It's it's a horrible book, but it's King. It's a and bad book. It's a I bit... never read the book. The movie was good. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's <laughs> not. I'm the scared of everything. Great. I laughed hysterically during yeah. the entire thing. I I, I rule Pet okay. Cemetery as a bad Stephen King book because he himself could not adapt it into a movie. And also, he doesn't remember writing it. Right. I liked it, so excuse me. Well, fuck you. Oh, no. No, he does remember writing it, but it's his least favorite book. I thought that was Christine. Yeah, I think it is Christine that he doesn't yeah. remember writing. Because that was his first one. Yeah, and I think he was on such no, a... No, wasn't like, Carrie his first one? No. Car yeah, Carrie was his first one, but he didn't publish it right away. Right. Carrie was good. Carrie was Hey, Carrie's good. great. The most original the, movie was yeah, good. Most of his first uh, first few books... Wait, he was did they on, remake like, that? Cocaine. What? Did yeah. they remake Carrie? Yeah, like yeah, twice. That was the most recent reiteration. Was horrible. Oh, with the uh, Hit Girl. Sure. Yeah, I think so. All I remember is that they had cell phones, and that created yeah. a giant plot hole. Yes, I remember. I I think I saw that in theaters. Fuck well, me. I think like the, before I that one. <laughs> <laughs> but before that <laughs> one, there was a second Carrie movie, and they like introduced rape to it, and it was like that's why she went all haywire and killed everybody. It was like, what are you doing? Like, no, <coughs> not, you don't need to do that. Yeah, you just kind of remove the religious... Oh, look, Dave, a bird! Them. Bullshit, doesn't exist. Not anymore. <sighs> you and your damn bird. Put it away, Casey. The only summer reading book that I actually enjoyed was reading Stiff. That was a great book. That was a bad follow-up to me talking about Casey's <laughs> <laughs> It's a book about, like, dead people and morticians and all that. And that made me want, well, not just that, but that made me want to go into mortuary science. Which I should have done. Uh, but... Yeah. There's always, my mom always told me three things. Oh, shit. We're going to need food, we're going to need medicine, and there's people that are always going to be dead. Yeah. And yeah, I became I mean... a teacher. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you know, I mean, you're, you're giving, you know, food for thought. Yeah, yeah, unfortunately, I'm mm -hmm. I'm training Terrible. this. I'm like, you don't feel do what I do. That. Yeah, do as I say, not as I do. Yeah, don't become a teacher. Horrible idea. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> I 100% agree. And it's because these kids these days How are can I reach these, <laughs> these damn kids. <laughs> they suck. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm gonna be mean for a second. They are really dumb. A second. Yes, a second. They're really dumb. <laughs> they need so much stimulus. That you really need to hold their hand throughout their entire high school career, and they just like a not finger tough. in the butt. They're not tough, and I think that really comes with all of this like mental illness thing, which like totally, totally understand. However, I really think that people are self-diagnosing and we're over-diagnosing, and there is a line between yes, mm -hmm. you have a mental illness versus you're just an asshole. Get tough, like get thick skin. Ooh, I, can I just get thick? <laughs> But yeah, so I, I heard just, stiff was a good book. Thick and stiff. Stiff is just... thick. <laughs> <laughs> and Steven is king. I got real. That, that derailed bad. He's like such a rat. A rat that can write. Well, yeah, I mean, he's great, but he looks like a rat. Like, I love people who Because he's look like, like 80. Animals. He's a rat that. No, he's like 70 something? All the time yeah. Cracking out all the Yeah, shit. his co author on it was fucking cocaine. He had a co author? No, it was cocaine. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> yeah. Why do you think there's over a thousand pages? And, and then, kept writing. and there's a, there's an underage kitty gangbang in it. He had a, he had a great but it, time. But it makes sense with it. Like, it makes sense in the book, yes. And but besides the fact, how young are kids anyway when they lose their virginity? These kids are like twelve. Yeah. I mean. <laughs> okay, I agree that's young. However, kids these days. I wasn't that young, Jesus. I'm not gonna comment on that. <laughs> <laughs> But I just, I just think kids are so eager to grow up, and yet they can't because their brains are just so dumb. <laughs> they can't do it. Like all the kids that I saw 
impracticum, so I won't mention school or anything, mm -hmm. but like, my God, they were just so disrespectful. They were just awful. They were like, what is going on? Yeah. They were the worst. They were the worst. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And that's a product of our public school system right here over mm -hmm. here with Casey. Yeah. I, I only went to three years of public high school. The rest of it was Catholic school. I want to teach at a Catholic school because they'll be fucking disciplined. Oh, well, yeah, they'll be yeah. disciplined, but yeah. you're getting, like, change. Yeah. It's like yeah, a solid 10 to 15 grand less. Which, yes. Which is terrible, I guess. And it, it's a clickier atmosphere because the parents are paying for it, right. so yeah. therefore they feel like they can dictate yeah. more yeah. in the classroom. It just Can might attest. be. It might be a good idea just for a couple of years or something, just for me to get tougher as a teacher. Because I always wanted to be the kind of teacher where I was like, "Oh, okay, today we're gonna do this, and you guys can always come to me no matter what." Like, no, fuck that. You're gonna do what I tell you to do. They also and you're gonna shut experience. up. So, uh, so hang on. So maybe not become a teacher, um, if that's your attitude. I'm, I'm I'm too far into it. Become a correctional. Become a dominatrix. You're disgusting. What? Jesus. Crack that whip. Yeah. Oh God, I actually really. Why am I disgusting? It. Not for that reason, but just because whips are cool. Why am I? That's it's a fair point. Mm -hmm. It's a fair fucking point. How am I going to use my college career to be that? Get creative. <laughs> Get creative. Have literary themed. Uh, Dom well, parties, I don't know. <laughs> Jane Austen. It's called a suppression party where you suppress the emotional feelings of sexual tension the entire time mm -hmm. and nothing ever happens but there's always the hinting that something might happen. Like You're, you're, you're going to be teased. You're going to be teased and teased and teased. You're never going to come but you're going to get teased. Oh, well, no, no, no. There, you, there's, you don't even get to that point. You still want to recommend this to your family? It. No, not anymore. <laughs> that was like at least five We're talking people. about Jane Austen though. He's talking about the, everything sex. Oh, Jane Austen is everything sex. <laughs> Not in the way he's talking. And about. the lack. Have you read it? No. Neither have I. But... <laughs> <laughs> I heard it was so bad. Like they had to take a class specifically on Jane Austen, it and was just rough. all of them bitched the whole time. I think the only one that didn't bitch was Molly, and that's because she, she never talk. fucking oh, talks. Molly's such a sweetheart. I love Molly. She's she awesome. got a puppy. She does. She, she, she got a pug. Yeah, it's a little. Pug she got a puppy. pug. So she got a puggy. And that's that's her nephew, right? Yes. The pugs are nephew? Mm -hmm. But yes. it's basically. <laughs> yeah. He's a cute kid. He's basically her son. He seems like a nice kid. Yeah, he's cute. He's like three or whatever. Yeah. But, you know, kids. Going back to kids real quick, I just want to make this one point, was that I was watching the Santa Claus 2 the other day, because it's been on, because it's Christmas time. Oh, hold on. Wait, the, the Tim Allen movie? Yes. They mean the second one? There's a There's third. There's a third. There's a third, but the, the third one is terrible. The second one's good. I the love first Martin one's Short, terrible. Though. I don't like Martin Short. However, um... I still need to watch my favorite Christmas movies. Mm. Oh, they did put a line from Toy Story into the second Santa Claus, but the whole idea is that he has to, you know, get married and fall in love and whatever to continue to be Santa. So he falls in love. Claus. Spoilers. If That's you weird. Seen this movie, he falls in love with his kid's principal. And oh, the I'm glad you finished that sentence. <laughs> <laughs> the interactions between the principal and the students <laughs> is exactly what I would want because she's at one point she's like, "Look into my eyes, and that is your future. And what do you see?" And he's like, "It's just black." And she's like, "Exactly." And then he just like runs away. Like I want that. I want these kids to be obedient and to listen and to be respectful. And I she don't. She wants think, to be a kitty dictator. I don't think <laughs> that is the worst. Idea. You want to be Why a are we giving them all this freedom when they're You want to be a child it? dominatrix. Ew! 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 <laughs> oh. Jesus Christ. I did, oh my god, though, I did have this one friend who wanted to, like, make a, a porn site, basically. Ooh. And he said, I'm going to name it Child Pornography. <laughs> now listen, his last name is Child. <laughs> so that's why That's he would perfect. <laughs> It's like, oh my god, you can't. Like, if it was a subscription service porn site, I would sign up just because of that. <laughs> it was so funny. God, he was so open about all that kind of stuff. And imagine all the creeps searching for it would no. just get his mm -hmm. his oh. website. Oh. How much money? Like, I've, I've hit the jackpot. <laughs> the jerk off jackpot. The jerk pot, if you will. Oh my god. Is that like the waffle? Yes. It just all goes there? Yes. Oh, okay. I'm Missy's family. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I think you should, yeah. still, you should still recommend it to your family. I don't know. I don't know. Recommend it to your sister. Which one? Um, uh, the... Carol Ann would be cool, though. 
Yes. The one that's not cool with it. <laughs> she, would, she would absolutely not be cool with it at all. How to put more of a schism in a family. But I, I'm, I'm trying <laughs> to distance myself from her a little bit at the moment. So that's fair. We'll, we'll, see. <laughs> we'll see how that's that fair. goes. This is not going to turn into, like, me just complaining about my family. <laughs> family time with yes, Missy. Yes, it will. <laughs> be like a whole session. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Family Time with Missy, <laughs> where she so complains shit. about her family for twenty whole minutes. Well, that's that's fine. You can you can know, you can borrow longer. my sister from time to time. Who's got a cool sister? I do. I, I do like your sister, She's and right. I I was terrified. You've never met her. Shut up. No, I have, Lynn. Yeah, I know. Yeah, of course I have. I know. I'm yeah, aware. Didn't you were at this party. Yeah, 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 I was there. Yeah, I'm aware. Okay. I've just been a dick. Oh, well, that's nothing new. But uh, okay. <laughs> she's very cool. No, I'm feeling fine. We had our first sibling outing the other day. We went to New Hope. A while ago. It was like last week. How'd that go? That was fine. What did you do? We went to New Hope because I was looking for a white elephant gift. And more token stops. Yes. Which I'm. No. Well, the two of them were in school, and then she got her her parents to uh, watch the youngest. Okay. Sweet kids. Yeah, they're excitable. As most children are. I mean, my nephew is uh, a great kid. Just going out there. Except he doesn't know how to answer his voicemail. He has a phone. He's ten years old. And he doesn't understand how a phone works. And so I had to teach that to him yesterday. Why do you judge? Because he's ten years old and he has a phone. Why do you judge? I'm impressed that he doesn't know how to use it. That, that I mean, I, yeah, which is Does he play great. Fortnite on it? Huh? Does he play Fortnite on it? No, he plays Fortnite on his uh, PS4 or whatever game uh, station. Uh, does, it, does it look like that? I don't know what it looks like. That's a PS3. I mean, it's similar. That's a PS4. I don't know, but he was telling me that he spent money on different skins for Fortnite, and I was like, oh, like money that you get in the game? No. I was like, no, real money. Yeah. No. I was like, how much did you spend? And he was like, well, I put forth like $25 from my money, and then from like parent money. That was a yep. totally different story. Yep, I was yep, like, yep. My, mind, you, mind you, those skins do nothing. Like they, they have a moth one. Of course, cool. That's fantastic. About three months after the meme ended. What meme? The moth and the lamp meme? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know fucking memes, dude. What? Jeez, Casey. Why would I know memes? I, don't, I, don't I have know. things to do. So do I. Get off your phone. You're being rude. You are <laughs> one to talk! <laughs> <laughs> we gotta start wrapping it up. All right. Okay. Cool. Yeah, we're all in agreement that. Uh, oh, we agree yeah, on I something. Think, um, I think Holy the next shit. time we oh. do this, even if it's like now, like it needs to be structured a little bit more. Why? Why? That no. was fun. That was an hour uh, of just pure no. ripping. It was just like all over the place. Yeah, yeah that's fine. That's like that's the best all part. Right, all right, all right. Mm -hmm. I mean, we right. can have some type of structure, but most of it's just going to be ad lib. Yeah. But I feel like there should be more of like a purpose to each one of your podcasts instead of us literally just talking about nothing. That was all substance. That was fun. Oh that was a, it was right. a good talk. We we literally just don't agree on this, so let's all right. just... let's wrap it up. It was a good talk. All right. Well, I came. thanks for including me this time. Well, no problem. The other time got deleted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We are a struggle city. Thanks no. for listening, guys. Goodbye. Talk to you whenever. <laughs>